I have always been passionate about changing things that you can change, and I think that that starts on a smaller, more local scale. You're not looking to change the entire world. You're looking to change your block. And I think building better hometowns means um, investing in the places that we love and not giving up on them. My name is Ruth Carlspin, and for the first time, I have a job that I'm proud of. Good morning, Mr. Green. Uh, good morning, Miss Roof. How are you? Got a cool morning to walk the work Ooh, today. We needed it because it has been very hot. This area has not had a full service grocery store in about 20 years. It's time the residents of Churchill are recognized as being people who have had to have the bare minimum, but still have to succeed, still have to survive. Harrisonburg, Virginia is a really old town. It's also in the middle of nowhere. Very, very rural, agricultural. There was no agency providing health care, so the homeless population basically had only one choice, and that was to go to the emergency room. The diagnoses are very fast. Diabetes, high blood pressure, you know, schizophrenia, depression, anxiety, and then the basic things. They're people, just like you and I, that need somebody to care for them. We take the kids out on a walk in the community to sort of point out all the things that we have and it sort of makes them start to think about what their community looks like. And then you flip it and you say, well, so what are we missing? What don't we have? What do we need? Anything that you think that is a need in your community, put it on the paper. But you're gonna have to develop the idea and sell it. And you can't just say, everybody will do it. Many of our students come from a home where they really don't have all of the things that larger communities have. It's good for them to have that opportunity and think about how can I maybe fix some of the problems that I see and help some of my community members get to a better place.